He's not done with the law just yet. Jury selection has now underway in the state trial against David DePap. He's the man who has already been convicted of two federal felonies for breaking into the home of former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi and attacking her husband. The dual trials are triggering new arguments from the defense. NBC's Sergio Quintana is at San Francisco's Hall of Justice. It was more than 18 months ago when David DePap allegedly broke into the Pacific Heights home of former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi and attacked her husband Paul with a hammer. And today, state prosecutors and DePap's defense began narrowing a jury pool of 120 people down to 12 jurors and six alternates. That jury will consider the eight state felony charges against DePap. Among them, the attempted murder of Paul Pelosi and two newly added charges, kidnapping and threatening a witness. In court, several potential jurors raised their hands when asked by the judge if they've ever seen someone do something because of a mental illness. And a few potential jurors also raised their hands to explain they've seen some of the video related to this case and know about DePap's federal conviction. This afternoon, DePap's public defender started to whittle the pool down by dismissing a couple of those jurors. Also in court today for a brief meeting with David DePap were his federal public defenders. They just filed a new motion about the federal sentencing hearing last week. Last week, U.S. District Judge Jacqueline Scott Corley sentenced David DePap to 30 years in prison for his two felony convictions. But DePap was not given an opportunity to speak during that hearing, meaning the hearing will now need to be held again. According to the new filed motion, DePap's attorneys would like to continue with the federal sentencing hearing, but plan on appealing, and they'd like Judge Corley to be replaced before that new hearing happens. The defense argues the current judge has already shown an unfair bias by imposing a sentence without allowing him to speak. The state trial is expected to pause next Tuesday so DePap can be present for the new federal sentencing hearing. In San Francisco, Sergio Quintana, NBC, Bay Area News.